approximately 7.22 this morning. We received multiple 911 calls of truck fire and have. Uh, personnel arrived on scene at that point. Uh, smoke and fire showing from the residence. Uh, the Seymour Fire Department responded. Uh, personnel went in. Uh, they forced entry into the uh, property. They located a, a male victim, approximately 70 years old, removed him, and then made entry with the hose lines to uh, extinguish the fire. Uh, they were subsequently removed from the structure as far as uh, it became unsafe for the firefighters inside. They came out and went to defensive operations at that point, and uh, the victim was transported to EMS to their care at that point. Can you talk about the condition of that victim when you heard that he was kind of gunshot into the head? I'll let the deputy chief speak to the, the victim's injury. Because of the heavy volume of fire, it appears there was a, a lot of uh, stuff inside. It was very difficult for the firefighters to move around, and uh, it, it was cumbersome for them to get in. It was burning. So because of safety conditions, the roof started to collapse. Uh, we needed to pop it and pull them out of that point and fight the fire from the outside. When you say a lot of stuff, do you think maybe like it, it potentially may have been. I have not seen the conditions inside, but additional reports were uh, that there was a 40 condition.